a mother of one of the students involved in the altercation at Pekin Schools, is breaking her silence. Jessica Wynn is apologizing for her daughter's behavior shown in the video that went viral last week. Um, I do want to apologize as a mother to a mother that I'm sorry for my daughter's behavior and her actions and that she took the situation way too far. Um, she, no, no child should have to be in a fight that extreme ever. The video shows her daughter repeatedly punching and kicking one student in the head. A female staff member nearby can be heard saying stop multiple times in the video, but does not intervene. Wynn says her daughter's behavior is not excusable. I don't condone her behavior. She was raised better than that. She was raised to have respect for others and to treat others the way that you would want to be treated. Pekin schools addressed the video last week after facing backlash. They dismissed the staff member shown in the video and said the student aggressor, Wynn's daughter, will face disciplinary consequences. Wynn said her daughter's outburst was caused by bullying that only worsened her depression and anxiety. She says her daughter was verbally abused by the student she is punching and kicking in the video. We reached out to the parent of the other student shown in the video to verify these claims. In a statement from their attorney, they said, It was not brought to our attention before the assault that our daughter was bullying anyone, nor have we seen anything to support that was the case. The video speaks for itself, and we will continue to focus on providing our daughter the support she needs while she recovers from this attack. This is not the first student altercation the school has seen. One day before the fight shown in the video took place, a different video showing two male Pekin students was shared online. Wynn says her 14-year-old daughter is now facing assault charges and will possibly be expelled. She says she hopes Pekin does not expel her daughter. The Pekin is only worried about their reputation and the matter of wiping their hands clean of a child with an IEP and mental health issues. I feel like it's easier for them just to say expel this girl because of all of the public. We reached out to the Pekin School District for further comment, but have not heard back. Reporting from Packwood, Blessing Molina, KTVO.